Welcome to Now Augmented. Now Augmented is all about augmented reality. My name is Michael and today I want to talk to you about stereoscopic photography, the next stage. It's velometric photography. If you don't want to miss our videos, please subscribe and be a nice guy, click the like. This episode was brought to you and is sponsored partly by Lev Warehouse is a warehouse for props. So if you ever need props for your video, go to Lev Warehouse. Enjoy after this intro. Today I want to talk with you about stereoscopic photography, what we talked last time. But I want to explain more about this photography. This is new photography, what we call volumetric photography, because it has a volume and you can photography uh, objects and make them 3D. That's the whole idea behind augmented reality is to take things from the virtual world and to put them in the real world in the right place, in the right moment, and to augment the reality. So you need to bring some information in, and sometimes you need to bring 3D objects. For instance, Napoleon. What he's doing here? Well, never mind. What we were gonna talk about is how we create this kind of photography. Remember the two cameras that I talked to you in the last episode? So what we do, we took these two cameras, we took this setup, and we are now photographing uh, what objects we want to place in this real world. So we actually, why, like I said before, we are filming it in advance, and then we are placing it in the right place. How we make it to be in the right place? You see in the middle, we have a light. This light, we put a mask in between the light bulb and the projector. And we have a lens in front that projects all the light on the surrounding. And now we get what we call structured light. You can look around it about in Google, you'll see there are all kinds of structured light. There are lines, there are uh, 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 dots, there are all kinds of structured light. But the idea is if you have structured light on objects, the distance between the lights, it, it bounces on a different di distance. The camera, when it films it, it sees it from different angles. You remember the stereoscopic camera, the two cameras? Now they film this structured light in different angles. So what it gets, it gets the image and when you stitch these two images again, you can make a difference between each pixel. So when you have, and the computer knows where each pixel is, you can decide which pixel will be in the new volumetric uh, uh, photography and which you can take off by algorithms. It's not so simple, but that's the idea. <laughs> 